All right, Lissette, it is, uh, what, a 12 and it's a scorcher already? Yeah, I'm, yeah. Not, I'm not loving it, but I'm also not loving the rain, so it's like a lose-lose, right. I feel like, at this point in time. Yeah. So, we, can never, we can never Less be rain, satisfied. more heat, right? And then yeah. we're going to see more rain as we head into the weekend, which is really bad timing, but at least it'll bring our temperatures down. So here's what we're tracking. The highs climbing to around 90 degrees today and tomorrow. A few storms possible, especially inland, and then moisture as we head towards the end of the week will enhance our chance for the showers and storms. There's that view from our Key West camera looking lovely and sunny and that of course allowing our temperatures to climb 89 degrees in Miami, 88 in Fort Lauderdale, 86 in Pembroke Pines, 88 in Kendall, upper 80s down through the Keys and as we look at the forecast, highs will be reaching around 91 in Sunrise, 90 in Plantation, 90 in Davie and Southwest Ranches, 89 in Pembroke Pines and in the coastal areas of Broward County, 84 in Dania Beach, 88 in Hollywood. Certainly going to be a hot Wednesday afternoon ahead. In Miami Day, the highs are around 90 in Miami Leaks and Doral, and forecasting a high of 91 in Miami, 87 in Coral Gables, 88 as we head into North Miami. And even through the evening, we're going to be warm with the low to mid 80s. Radar is quiet right now, and the winds are calm or light out of the southeast, east, and that would help to carry any storms that do develop towards the western suburbs likely of Broward County as we're seeing 2 p.m. Weston and Southwest Ranches could be dealing with some showers, possibly a storm there along 595 and then also still a chance of some storms here along US 27 and near the Turnpike and some of these storms could be a little close for comfort as we get into 4 p.m. over the Everglades and could indeed move eastward towards some of the uh, metro areas as we get into the evening around 7 p.m. Our meteorologist Dave Warren will We'll be tracking it all so stay tuned for that so as we head into tomorrow 90 degrees still going to be sizzling and steamy and then we go into the weekend and there's a change in the pattern as we have more moisture around that'll lead to some more showers temperatures will be closer to normal in the mid to upper 80s which is seasonable for this time of year but there will be more clouds as you're making your plans for the weekend and also the chance for some scattered storms saturday and sunday the breeze will also be building and all these elements will lead to our temperatures being closer to normal